But so far, what have been the strengths that you've seen on offense? Well, I think we're running the ball pretty consistently. Uh, you know, all the backs are running it well. Offensive line has been very, you know, very solid, and, and they're doing a great job. I mean, they're extremely underrated. I mean, those guys, they all come out to practice every day, and they work. I mean, Damian Woody and Mike Compton sets the tone every day. Matt Light is a different player this year. Uh, you know, Brand Stye, we added him. Russ Hoxstein was in there doing a great job. And when Joe Andrews gets back, Clem's done a great job. I mean, everyone's really, they're taking their role, and I think everyone's working on it because we realize that 9-7 isn't good enough, and, and you, we've got to be better than that. We've got to be more consistent on offense. And for that, everyone's got to look themselves and really pick their, you know, pick their role and do it well. That offensive line, as you just mentioned, that's got to boost your confidence knowing that the guys in front of you are there to protect you, and they're doing a good job. Yeah, no question. And not only are they there to protect me, but they're also to protect our running backs. And when our running backs do well, and that's like a quarterback's best friend. I mean, with the quarterback, from the quarterback position, if you're able to run the ball, it sets up all your play action pass. You're never in third and longs. You're staying on the field. You know, they've got they've got to defend everything. So if we want to be successful, we have to run it and throw it. And with, I think it all starts with those guys up front and those guys off in the front. And so far, I think they've done just a great job. No matter what plays we call, you know, it, it's going to be, you know, we're going to be trying to do it the best we can. So we're, I think one of those, in the preseason, you know, you can afford to, to keep trying things out, you know, because the games really don't count. Uh, so, you know, if we start off running slow or, you know, we'll stick with it and we're, we're going to try to establish, you know, our mentality. And that's to be a pretty balanced team. So it's not going to get uh, really out of whack one way or another, whether it be running or throwing. Uh, will you try to throw the ball downfield more often this season? Because last year the uh, passing game was extremely effective, but never went for more than 50 yards in one play. Right. Uh, will you continue trying to chip away at the short yards, or do you think you'll throw uh, long this time? Well, I think at, you know when you're able to stretch the field vertically and mm -hmm. get those guys running, you know, catching those go routes yep. and making big plays and scoring quick touchdowns, it takes a lot of pressure off. You know, True. those 12 play drives. You know, you convert right. every third down. So. Something that I think if you guys been out here today, you're watching and mm -hmm. we're trying to, to really establish that type of, of game. And, and then it opens up thing underneath and it opens up the intermediate stuff. And almost like everything feeds off one another. So um, that's going to be important for us mm -hmm. to do. And when we do take those shots, we've got to hit them because it's mm -hmm. not just to throw them deep. I mean, you want to throw them deep and complete them. Mm -hmm. Christian said a lot of the first teamers don't get too many reps, obviously, in the first game. So you really got to hit your spots. You that more, much more scrutinized maybe for this first game because like, you know, you're not, you're not going to be there for two quarters. Yeah, probably. And I, and I think, um, you know, a lot of times you go out there in the first quarter and sometimes you're you're getting a feel for the game. You don't do as well. So it, it'd be nice to go out there and really put on a good, you know, put together some plays and, and make it look crisp and make it look like we know what we're doing out there. And, uh, it's always a play. Yeah, I'm pretty confident we're going to be able to do that because we've been, you know, we've been having good solid practices and, um, you know, I think the guys are, are that much more experienced than what we're trying to do offensively.